Hello everyone and welcome to another Art for Alzheimer's Care project video. Today we are going to be making a painted butterfly. So to get started you'll want to print off the free template of the butterfly. Just use the link in the description. It is free to do so. You'll also want some watercolor paints, a jar of water and a paintbrush, and possibly a napkin for dabbing any extra paint or water with. Alternatively, if you do not have any paint on hand, you can use markers or pencil crayons. So go ahead and let your loved one paint in the butterfly to however they choose. It doesn't matter if they stay in the lines because we will trim off all of the excess paper on the outside afterwards anyways. If painting both sides of the butterfly is too much work for your loved one, let them paint one side and you can paint the other side for them and make it a collaborative project. Now once you've got the butterfly painted in on both sides, go ahead and let that project dry. It shouldn't take very long. And then once it's dry, you can cut out the butterfly. So as you can see here, I'm cutting around the outside. And then once I get to the inside, what I've done is I've folded it in half and then cut the inside out that way. You can also separate the butterflies to get out that inside piece. Um, I just choose to fold them because it's a nice way to line them up afterwards. So once you've got them cut out, you can fold both halves together and then glue them together with your disappearing purple glue. So now the butterfly has a front side and a back side. And you can fold the wings along the lines on the body and then give the wings a little curl to make it look more realistic. like so. So this is optional, but when I do this project with clients I like to include a piece of green paper for them to make a leaf out of it. So I've just grabbed a sharpie marker here and I'm drawing a leaf. And then I'm going to cut it out and use it as something for the butterfly to sit on top of. So just adding a little dab of glue, I'm going to put the butterfly's body on top of that dab of glue and press it down. And there you go. A little 3D painted butterfly. This is a fun project and I have found that with my own clients. Um, they enjoy looking at the project once they have finished it. They enjoy picking up the wings to see both sides. And overall they just seem to be pleased with the work that they have done. So. I hope that you enjoy this project too. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe. And if you know anyone who could benefit from my content, go ahead and share it with them. I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Bye-bye.